31 and 6. They have uh, gone past Boston after beating the Celtics on Christmas Day. Fisher on the three. To Farmar and Bujic. He's having to play big, big minutes. And Luke Walton as well out. Uh, Duncan giving a little space, couldn't get it over to Sol, and Colby gets the rebound. Of course, the Spurs look changes in about a minute when Ginobili comes in. Beautiful feed from Bryant. He went to be a scorer. He's obviously one of the top scoring threats of the Spurs, leading them in points as Bryant hangs for two. Doesn't catch it deep enough anymore. He'd rather face. Oh, Parker spinning, going the other way. Back to the paint area. Realize, hey, I'll give up the jump shot. I'm not going to allow you to get to the cup. Does a good job sacrificing his body and takes San Antonio's third. He goes to the bench, picking up his second foul. And the rookie, George Hill, has checked in as Odom. Guy that's defending you every trip down the floor. Find a way to get on the ball. Kobe. On Ginobili for two. Oh my, I got a problem, though. You, top three players in the league. You're talking about the best in the world. And you have two and a question mark. And on Kobe, his first five and a half left. Mr. Final Four, Kobe Bryant. Spurs by three inside of five minutes here. First half as Gasol after the shot attempt of the night for Finley, who's played over a thousand NBA games. Kobe and Mark. And this is a good defense. And sometimes as a coach, you have to say, hey, the guy just got it done. That's good defense, keeping him in front, contesting. That's just better offense. I don't see a foul right there. That's a front. <laughs> You know, no matter what arena you're in, guys, anytime. Third three-pointer for the Spurs here tonight, or fifth, I should say. Three for the Lakers, and um, there's something seriously special about his competitive instinct. 13th year in the league. Man. You know, we have this timeout, last two trips. Beautiful. Time is on target. The unselfishness, the ability to play inside and out. Yeah, like like there, you know, this right up in. Uh, offensively, really carrying the offensive end of their team. Kobe Bryant knocking down the jump shot. We know he's tough to defend when you allow him to get to the paint. Now you have your hands full, knocking down contested jump shots, three-point plays, getting into the interior of the Spurs defense, and then when you damn the knockdown shots, he's a guy that, that will put the dagger in. Second, watched by Bynum. Roger Mason put it on the deck around Kobe and Bryant comes up with the block, but Duncan pointed. I thought I had it. Fisher a three, and the Lakers who had open. I don't know if it's midlife crisis or something, <laughs> but anyway, I, I Kobe is the line. On what you eat and how hard you work in the summer, you cannot go and take summers off anymore. With uh, his good free throws, made 11 in a row before missing one last night. Going to game 11 seconds. Bryant back in. Ariza the three. Good was a below average passer, particularly out of the double team. Now an outstanding passer. Here. Two four. In purple. For three. For the for the Lakers, they can get to four and three here. Powell taking a big shot, making it. Bryant calling for Powell again, wants to go with Ola Lyle. Same deal, same spot. Took a shot and knocked it down again. It started with the Kobe corner three. Knocked down the jumper and then be a facilitator. Pick and roll basketball, finding Powell. When you play with great players, you don't have to do much, but be ready and when your time comes, knock down the jump. Right. That's quite a, uh, that's the statement of leadership right there and how much someone wants to win. A oh, beautiful jump pass to Odom. I, I do think he got it turns into a pass. A wide open look, but the defense takes their eyes off of Bryant. Of all of them ready to catch in position. Unselfish basketball by Bryant. Get the best possible shot. Well, that shot was Lamar Odom at the rim. The soul of the screen. He swings, he shoots for the lead. 400 to 89. Spurs in this quarter. The Lakers have come back and Bryant over Mason connects. Mason guards Kobe. Four second difference. Bryant a three. Good! Kobe a three!
own building. And how about that man that Van Gundy says, the last four minutes, are you kidding me? Knocks down the long ball, giving his team the two-point lead. And doing the Sam Cassell jog back. Oh, my. You're joking with you a little bit, but the MVP of the league the last four minutes of the game, this is the six-minute mark, really started taking over the game with decisions in addition to shot making. But these decisions, simple plays, simple passes. Well, if you're playing against him defensively and all he's doing is jacking up shots, it's easy to defend. Right. But when he's making plays and being a willing passer, now it makes you indecisive as a defense and you're late to rotate. Now all of a sudden, George Mason is saying, I got to back up and be ready for the screen and roll. And another guy. Oh, they did foul earlier, so the foul would get him to the line. Inbounds to Bonner, game over. Spurs win.